You talked, Micah, about the comparison mm -hmm. between Messi and, and Ronaldo, and that's the sort of breath, same breath that we're, we're talking about Erling Haaland in. As you said, he's a, he's a number nine, he's an out-and-out -out number nine. Mm -hmm. And so you would expect his, his goal-scoring figures to stand up to them. But they don't just stand up to Messi and Ronaldo, he's surpassing them. And if he carries on like this, he would reach, after the same number of games as, as Messi and, and, and Ronaldo have, have played, or same number as Ronaldo has played, on 1,015 career goals for Erling Haaland. That's the, that's the projection if he carries on scoring at, at this rate. But if you look... Messi and Ronaldo both picked up at around about this stage. So that, and that's possible as well. Careers, they? And, they, and they've, you know, they're, they're <laughs> pretty well regarded. <laughs> the, the only thing I, w I will say, because I, I know a lot of people looking at and how can you compare Haaland to Messi and Ronaldo, we're talking about purely goals. This is just numbers. Just purely numbers and goals. because it, and, they, and this is club and country. And the other thing we should say as well is that Norway haven't qualified for a couple of tournaments as well, whereas Argentina, Portugal, they're sort of... Ever, mm. not, ever, not quite ever presence, but they're, they're usually there. Yeah, I, I think um, in terms of Messi, we know what he can do in terms of goals and assists and at times he'd play up front on the right, number 10 in them positions. We're Rina familiar with his work. Uh, yes, <laughs> Ronaldo as well. Don't forget, yeah. he started off as a winger yeah. and then he matured into sort of goal scorer, number nine, movement in the box. But in terms of numbers, especially in the Premier League as well, what Haaland is producing now at his age is just staggering. Absolutely mm. unbelievable. In there, he's so sharp. And in terms of the numbers, what, what, what you've shown us there, there's no reason he can't surpass that because of, as long as he stays injury-free, you always got to talk about injuries because if he plays in a team like Man City, constantly creating chances for him, he's going to get yeah. them opportunity got, to score them. 263 goals in 317 games. If you just think about that for a second, how difficult that is to do. Mm -hmm. Of course, he's playing in a great side that create lots of chances for him, but it is staggering. It's staggering. And it looks like, you know, you figure things out as you, as you get older as well, looking after yourself, making sure you, you, know, you eat correctly and, and you'll prepare yourself, ice baths and all these things that he speaks about regularly doing to just give himself that little bit of an edge. Yeah, he's, he's a phenomenon, the guy. He's a, a, an, an amazing player to watch and he's so different to the other two that you've mentioned. And, and I don't think for one second we're going to compare their styles or anything like that, but an out-and-out -out goal scorer, mm -hmm. it's very hard you know, to, to think of anyone that's so as clinical and as has every single goal in the bag.